back here. Today we're gonna be messing with the wagon. So the front fitment, I'm not too, I haven't been up too much of a fan of because it doesn't match the rear camber perfect and the poke. So I got some spacers and I'm gonna adjust the camber up top, try to get that fitted and looking good. So I got 15 mil spacers that are hub centric. Only thing I hate about 15 mil is that the studs stick out, but the T's have a gap in the back, so I think it should be good. But I'm just gonna double check that, obviously. So you see how the studs stick out here? Luckily, these wheels have space in between so that's not gonna be an issue at all but I also gotta add camber up top so I'm gonna throw this on just because but I know I have to adjust the camber So it airs out there, but it's pushing the fender. I'd rather add the camber so that it matches the back. That's poking OD. So I'm just gonna add the rest of this camber that it has. It's like centered right now. So I'm just gonna push that back to the end and that should give me enough clearance to have the tire sit good. So now, it's very little, but it you can see the difference compared to what it was before. So you can see now the wheel pokes out a little bit, and this is before, basically flushed with the car, and it's the same fitment. It's actually a little bit tighter now, because here I can fit my finger through the whole thing and here now it's on the fender so I'm gonna do the other side now I'll probably just do it right there squeeze myself in and get that done so as you guys saw installed the spacers added the camber to me it looks so much better the camber is now matching front and rear you can kind of tell here, or well, you could definitely tell obviously before it didn't poke at all. And definitely need an alignment because this is with the uh, steering wheel like this and the wheel is straight. So if I put it, oh it's locked. But obviously you can tell the wheel is completely straight there, steering wheel there. So the alignment got uh, thrown completely off, which, was, which I was expecting anyway, so whatever. But yeah, I think the wagon looks good now that the front tire pokes a little bit more I'm not gonna lie I do hate being able to see the studs of the spacer like that maybe I'll spray paint it all black but whatever it's probably just bothering me now but I'll probably get used to it so yeah subscribe to the channel like the video share it if you like the content that I'm doing I'm gonna be trying to post as often as I can I'm doing updates on the Civic that video of that bumper is out I'm gonna be getting the exhaust work done, which is probably gonna be next week's video. So yeah, I'm enjoying showing the process to everybody.